Hi, I'm Micah Grubbs, and today we are going to be answering your most common Pennsylvania liquor license questions. Uh, the state of Pennsylvania uh, operates on a quota system. There are multiple kinds of licenses that people acquire, the most common being an R, the second most being a D. R's are for restaurants, D's are for distributors. The process is this. Uh, all licenses are owned by somebody. They are not owned by the state. Therefore, you have to find somebody who is willing to sell their license to you. Uh, once you've identified a person that wants to sell it, you've identified a price, next step is to hire an attorney. That attorney puts a purchase agreement together that both parties sign. Once those parties sign it, typically the attorney enacts the transfer process where they would file a lot of paperwork with the state and they would start the process of transferring it from one entity to another. Uh, there are multiple types of transfers, uh, one being person to person, one being uh, person and place to new person and place, and another being place to place. So typically it would be a person and a place to a person and a place, which means that the LCB is going to come out and visit your location. They're gonna interview the new buyer, they're gonna make sure that they've paid their taxes, and they're gonna put them through a bunch of, a series of steps to make sure that they're a qualified buyer. Once that process is complete, the state uh, approves the license for transfer, the seller signs a certificate of completion, and the new buyer takes over the license and begins selling alcohol at their new space. So if you were in the market to buy a liquor license or you were looking for an assist in selling yours, uh, please give me, Micah Grubbs, a call at the Safranco Advisory Group or PA Liquor License Company. Uh, you can find us online or uh, click the links below and get in touch with me that way. Uh, I would be happy to assist in any way that I can.